Last weekend, I, like some of you, dressed up for Halloween in an attempt to mask my true self. Sometimes we mask our true selves without even really thinking about it. My name is Jocelyn Apodaca. I'm a graduate student from the Greenspan School of Journalism and Media Studies, and today I'd like to talk to you about something we all use to mask our true selves, Instagram. The premise of my study investigates the motives for using Instagram, whether users are portraying their true selves online, and how it affects their life satisfaction and well-being. I'd like to note that according to Instagram, there are 95 million photos and videos posted to the site per day. It is one of the top four social media networking sites, and yet there's very little research being done on its users. Women are the primary users of such sites and are generally more affected by their content. Women ages 18 to 29 are the primary users of Instagram, and for that reason, my research focuses primarily on them. I use this survey to determine whether or not users are portraying their true selves based on previous research. I determine what their motives are and how it affects their life satisfaction. Researchers Tosin, Papacarisi, and Mendelssohn have conducted similar research in motive and social networking sites and have determined these five motives. Interpersonal connection, entertainment, information seeking, identity, and diversion. And they're um, defined here. Your true selves are defined as your perceptions of the world, your background, and culture. You determine how you present yourselves in the offline world. With, research, with previous research and guidance from my advisor, I determine if those perceptions translate over into the online world. Now, this research is important for many reasons, and not just to us social researchers. Determining online behaviors is the perfect way for advertisers to reach you. For employers, searching for the perfect job candidate. For marketing and social branding. And determining how social media affects well-being could be helpful for psychologists and doctors. But above all else, Instagram is a perfect medium for storytelling, something we all use as an innate need to connect. Thank you.